All right, this is how you know we're at the show. The wacky flailing inflatable arm flailing two men. 7.15 a.m., getting ready to head out the door. We got the showcases, there they are. Got them loaded up, ready to go. And we got a couple cheap boxes here, dollar boxes and stuff like that. Let's get it, let's get it. Keep the showcases loaded up. It makes it easier to put them in the car. And just like that, we're good to go. Got a bunch of grass in here though, of course, because I'm a big golf guy. So we got all the Bermuda grass in the back. Stack up the old repacks there, the value box, and the dollar cards. Let's go. Pack it up. We gone. <sighs> Can see your breath this morning. It's going to be a chilly one. Once again, more issues with the microphone, but I think we got it working now, so we should be good. We came inside. We're all set up. It's just after 9 o'clock. show just got started. Here's a look at the table. So this show is actually kind of unique too. We do a couple of these around North Carolina, but half of this show is toys and collectibles and things like that. And then this half of the room over here is sports cards. So it's a little bit divided, but kind of nice. It gets more people in the door. So if they're coming to look at toys or something, they can make their way over and see some sports cards as well. So definitely good for the hobby. I like having these shows that are mixed like this, brings in a diverse crowd. Got a couple of showcases set up. Got the uh, value boxes down here. Sorry, I want to get you in the shot, huh? I want to be famous. We can put you on YouTube. Showcase is loaded up. Still got the Jalen Waddle downtown. Let me know if you want that. Got some good stuff in here. Did pick up a Matthew Stafford auto already. Second year, Crown Rail out of 15. Love it. Too cheap to pass on. We also have these new packs, guys. This is $25 at the show, or you can do a coin flip with me. You can either pay $30 if you lose or $15 if you win. $25 mystery packs. These are loaded with refractors, rookies, autos, patches. Come and get them. All right, guys, I'm like the worst of this, but we did have one person take their chances on the pack, $25 pack. We did the coin flip. They lost. That's right. One in the books for this guy right here. But they got some cool stuff. They got some refractors, some patches, some autos. They were pretty happy with it. So glad it worked out. Appreciate the business, guys. We'll keep it going here. All right. All right, what's up, guys? Just did a deal here with Mark. I appreciate it. I got a Josh Allen Blue Rated Rookie PSA 9 and 120 bucks in cash. Taking home the Jalen Waddle Laser. Hopefully looking to grade it. Jalen Waddle downtown. Looking to grade it. Super clean. Got that last week. So I uh, appreciate the deal, man. Yeah. Absolutely. Have a good, one. good luck with it. I hope it grades out for you. Okay, look, as you can see, I am home. I wanted to get more footage from the show, but unfortunately there really wasn't a lot going on, especially for deals that happened at my table. Um, I did not sell a ton today, which is okay. I've said this before. It always gets slower this time of the year. The shows are not always the best foot traffic wise or you know sales wise. A lot of people just kind of window shopping because they've got the holidays coming up. But this is ridiculous. So we've got a massive, massive pickup day today. These cards right here are absolutely amazing. Be sure not to miss this stuff. These cards right here are pretty good. And then I got all of this right here. This is all hockey that I picked up from the gentleman that was set up next to me, Shane. I appreciate the deal on these, but if you ever see this, absolutely crazy stuff. So I just want to show you this um, so you guys can see this. But yeah, this is probably my best pickup day, best show for buying some stuff ever. A couple of these cards are absolutely ridiculous. Um, so yeah, hopefully you guys enjoy this. I'm just going to kind of go through some of the stuff that I picked up today. If you haven't done this already, please go ahead and subscribe to the page. We're getting very, very close to a thousand subscribers now, uh, getting to about the 700 mark. So we're getting there. Um, also, if you could like the video and comment below what you like from here, I really appreciate it. And, uh, make sure you check out the freebie Friday videos. If you guys haven't seen those every Friday, I'm doing weekly giveaways. Make sure you get in on those as well. I'm going to try to go in order, if I can remember right here, in order from first to last pickups through the show as the day went on. This was the very first thing that I got when I got in there. This is a second year, so 2010 Matthew Stafford Crown Royale Gold Die Cut numbered out of 15, and it's an auto. So I picked this up. I'm a huge Matthew Stafford guy. I already have several autos, but I was like, you know what? I'm going to pick up another one. I got a really good price on that one. Um... These other two right here, you saw this one in the deal earlier that came up to my table, the Josh Allen PSA 9. 
We did also get a Wander Franco rated prospect red auto out of 99. This is an on-card auto. Cool deal on that one too. Guy came up to my table, was just looking to sell some cards, so I did buy that one. This Vlad Guerrero out of 25. This is the orange fluorescent, I think it is. Uh, this came up to my table as well. Uh, another kid wanted to do some trading with me, so we just kind of, I think I kicked in cash with the card that I had for this, if I remember right. So we got that one. And then all of this other stuff. Oh, also the Max Scherzer, an immaculate patch auto of Max Scherzer out of 25. It's a pretty sweet card too. Uh, this one also came up to my table, did like a cash plus trade for that. Everything else here though, uh, well, there's a few more things that I picked up here that I bought from the guy across from me. Everything else came from Shane who was right behind me. Um, but I found a Matthew Stafford, and again, these are not the prices that I paid, but Matthew Stafford gold out of 50 there, a Philip Gustafson Young Guns, a Julius Irving Tops card, Kevin Garnett Electric Court right there for the 90s guys, uh, Tiger Woods 2000 British Open Champions out of 3499 That actually did come from Shane at the end there. And then so did these last two. This one is really, really cool. So there's an upper deck Barry Sanders patch card. This is a game used patch numbered out of 99 right there. I just thought this card was awesome. Old school upper deck. So that was pretty sweet. And also this Michael Jordan. This is the 1995 Skybox Standouts Michael Jordan. So I picked this up also. This is a pretty cool insert. Uh, so we got that one. Some of these cards, though, I mean, I'm absolutely ridiculous. I can't believe the deal that I got on these two. I'll just give you a taste. There are four really, really big cards that I got that are going to be kind of sprinkled throughout this next section of the video as I'm going through the hockey and stuff, but I'll show you the first one right here. So this one is a 2012 Panini Barry Sanders uh, Auto numbered to 20. Eight out of 20. Barry Sanders auto right there, which is pretty sweet. Actually, through all my card collecting and stuff, even though I'm from Michigan and I'm a Lions fan, I think this is the very first Barry Sanders auto I've actually had, but got a really cool deal on that one. And there's a few more. Don't Make sure not to miss these ones. I mean, just really big. We got two rookie autos and one that's like a second or third year for a guy. I'm going to show you that here in a little bit. But I want to go through some of this hockey stuff too, um, just so you guys can kind of see. What got this started is the guy right behind me, Shane. He had some stuff that was in these big like four row boxes that were not actually on the table. I started going through and noticed he had some hockey. Obviously, again, being from Michigan, being a Red Wings fan, there were some in here. So there was like an Alex Del Vecchio, had a 75 cent sticker on it. This is a Jimmy Howard uh, two color patch out of 50 and a Thomas Holmstrom autograph. So I saw those and I was like, hey man, like I'd be interested in maybe buying like all the hockey or you know if we can work out a deal, I definitely want the Red Wings stuff. So he's like, yeah, I don't really do much with hockey. Like if you want to look through there, just make me an offer. So I gave him an offer. He accepted for all of this hockey stuff. So I got this whole lot. But check this out. We got a Steven Stamkos auto in there, captain of the Tampa Bay Lightning. Just won a couple of Stanley Cups with them. So this is a pretty sweet card there. Also had a Wayne Gretzky Trilogy. This thing is sweet. So it's frozen in time. This is like the acetate card. It's a little bit thicker. It looks like it's made of ice. And it's numbered right there to $5.99. So that was really, really cool. Uh, we also have hand-numbered 3 out of 19 on-card auto two-color patch Tyler Seguin for the Bruins. That's a really cool one as well. Uh, a couple of young guns in here. So JT Comfer for the Avalanche. And then Eric Comrie, young guns, Winnipeg Jets, goalie. So we got both of those. This was in there too. This one I thought was really, really cool being a golf fan. He's also a lefty golfer. I'm left-handed. Uh, Mike Weir, gold exquisite auto of Mike Weir on card. That was pretty nasty as well. Uh, also got a deal on a Derek Henry red yellow optic rated rookie a tops finest fact lebron james numbered to 1899 i actually bought one of these from the local card shop a while back sent it into sgc got it graded and sold it so happy to have one of those back and two rated rookies here both from optic lamar jackson and luka Doncic. lamar jackson and luka Doncic. so we got those in a little package deal as well and then this stuff here is the rest of the hockey just pick this up without knocking it over Look at all that. Look at all that hockey stuff, man. If you're a hockey guy, this video is for you. 
All right, before we get too much further, though, I do want to show you another one of the nasty pickups. I can't decide which one I want to show. So I think we're going to go basketball on the next one. So let's see. What was the first one? The first one was the Barry Sanders. So we had football. There's another football, a baseball, and a basketball. This one's nasty, though. On-card rookie signatures from Vanguard 2017-18. Jason Tatum. Jason Tatum on-card rookie signatures auto it's out it's from vanguard numbered to 99 on the back right there number to 99 jason tatum rookie auto absolutely nasty card right there that is so sick all right back to the hockey though boone jenner numbered card brandon sutter carolina hurricanes auto uh dominic poolin autograph Rod Gilbert, New York Rangers, autograph. We actually have, this one's pretty cool. I did not know the name. Uh, I don't follow the Columbus Blue Jackets that closely either, but Grant Klitsum, one of one printing plate auto. So that is a one of one right there on the back as well. So that's a cool card. Nico Hirscher, Hirscher, I always pronounce his name wrong. New Jersey Devils, upper deck portraits though, absolutely nasty. Uh, Marcus Nutivara, that is a rookie and also numbered right there above the nameplate. That one's out of 249. Saku Koivu, that's a black diamond. Uh, ben Ferrero, rookie, numbered to 799. Is that right? Yeah, 799 there. Uh, Jonas Hillier, there is a Kevin Roy or Kevin Wah, depending on where you're from. Young Guns as well. Uh, Blaine Stoughton for the Hartford Hartford Whalers. Can you believe that? That's a throwback right there. Hartford Whalers. That's pretty cool. Auto as well. Uh, Patrice Bergeron patch. That one is not numbered, I don't think. It's game-worn material. Vladimir Tarasenko upper deck canvas. It's a pretty cool card. Two Charlie McAvoy rookies. One is the black border. Uh, both glossy rookies from OPG. And then we've got Henrik Lundqvist, Upper Deck Canvas as well. Doing a big stretch there. It's kind of cool. David Pasternak, Upper Deck Canvas. That one's pretty sweet. Kind of has like some more color in the background and stuff. Kind of almost looks like a color blast there. James Neal, Patch Card. That's pretty sweet. Uh, let's see what else we got. Tim Thomas. This is like a game used uh, patch right there as well. Brad Marchand. Carey Price, two color patch there. Um, Martin St. Louis, Big Patch, Canada. Uh, there's an exquisite one. So Pavel Buchnevich for the Rangers. This is a this is an upper deck exquisite patch auto numbered out of 89. Right, 89. Yeah, that's pretty cool. 2016-17, 2016-17. We need to get some McDavid stuff. Yeah, right. Well, not for the price that I paid. Uh, Matt Hendricks, rookie. Rookie Premier, numbered out of $7.99. And we're about halfway through the hockey, so I'm going to take another break, and we're going to show one more of the massive cards. Here we go. Are you guys ready for this? 1998 Collector's Edge Rookie Inc. Peyton Manning. Peyton Manning on card, Rookie Auto, Collector's Edge. Absolutely disgusting. Let's go. That's a big card right there. Back into the hockey we go. We have a Byron Defoe game-worn jersey. Steven Stamkos game-worn jersey. This one actually is a really cool card. I have no idea who this is. Silver version of Clark Gillies autograph. No clue. Rob Blake. I remember him from when I was growing up. Longtime captain and defenseman for the LA Kings. There is a Luca Spiza patch card. Mark Shuffley, Shifley, uh, autograph for the Winnipeg Jets. He's a pretty good player with Winnipeg. Uh, Rick Nash Trilogy Patch, 4 out of 10 honorary swatches. And this card right here, probably the most disgusting card that was in here. This is the Chin Strap card from National Treasures of Carl Soderberg. Rookie card also, 3 out of 3. A Boston, Boston Bruins fans dream card right there three out of three chin strap rookie auto uh 69 70 tony esposito 
best rookie. That's a pretty nasty card as well. Carl Hagelin, rookie, 46 out of 62 from the New York Rangers. Uh, Brad Marchand, again, probably my least favorite hockey player of all time. Rod Gilbert, New York Rangers. Phil Meyer. And we have Andre DuPont. Guy Lafleur, old school Canadians hockey player there. Ivan Cornoyer. Cornier, probably, is how it's pronounced. That's pretty cool, too. This is from 71-72. Uh, so some pretty early hockey in here as well. Bobby Clark. Uh, Cody Hodgson, Buffalo Sabres autograph right there. David Clarkson, another New Jersey Devils autograph. Reggie Leach, Philadelphia Flyers. Miko Koivu, Patch from the Minnesota Wild. Orland Kurtenbach for the Hartford Whalers as well. Um, Brandon Sutter, Carolina, Carolina Hurricanes. That one is numbered as well. That one's out of 100, so 63 of 100 there. Chris Higgins, signatures from the Carolina, or I'm sorry, Montreal Canadiens. Mark Savard, private signings. That's also pretty cool for a Boston fan. There was a guy there, too, that was at the show who is a Boston fan and had some Bobby Orr autos. I should have taken some of these over to him to show him before I left, but I totally forgot. So I'm going to have to try to connect with him at some point. There's another one of those frozen in times like the Wayne Gretzky, but this is Martin Brodeur, also numbered out of 599, which is a pretty nasty card. Uh, Drew McIntyre, autograph. And last but not least, Tyler Ennis, patch out of 75. And here we go, guys. The nastiest, sickest, absolutely most ridiculous pickup of the day. This card is ridiculous. I still can't believe this. This is nuts. Leaf Limited 2004 St. Louis Cardinals Albert Pujols autograph. Jersey number 5 out of 10. 5 out of 10 jersey number. Albert Pujols auto from 2004. Absolutely ridiculous deal on this. Thank you, Shane, so much. Appreciate it. This is a sick card. I love this thing. I don't think this is ever going anywhere. I'm probably going to keep this thing forever. Thanks, guys, for checking out the video, and I will catch you next time.